Hmm. This time it's impossible to lower the garden. I better continue on my way. But you're not at the village, Gustav. I wanted to check the balloon. What do you want, Ariane? I'm sorry, but I have to go to the city at once. No problem, Ariane. I'll take you there. I have to be at the market very early tomorrow morning anyway. Thanks. Here at last, Ariane. I was waiting for you to come back. Adam asked me to watch over you. Really, I appreciate it, Enrique. Enrique, I absolutely must see Wallace. At this hour? Well, you might find him at the university. Damn, I noticed that they're guarding the entries to the Alta Monorail stations. Now I know that the war is only a rumor devised by Alexander, the rector of the academy, to start up his diamond business. The truth is, he sells them for his own profit. That's horrible. One of his accomplices is Armanda, the druggist. That's why she's standing in front of the tower. What a loathsome woman! Wait for me. I'll be back. All right, Ariane.
I could get rid of Beret's Mahul by pretending there's a call from Armanda. I need the number of the phone cell by the tower. Nope, the entry is guarded by the Rector's cronies. Any news? Enrique, there's a phone booth by the tower at the intersection. Do you know the number there? By heart? No. But here's a list of all the phone booths in the city. The number we need is in the lower district. Thanks. That'll be a big help. Good luck, Ariane. Wait for me. I'll be back. All right, Ariane. I need more information.
Hello, Berets Mayul. This is Armanda. Yes, what is it? It's all right. You can leave your post. I'm going to stay, but be discreet. Will do. Do I really want to go there? All right, let's go.
Ah, Elian, what a pleasure to see you again. Maybe, but I don't think you'd like what I have to say to you. You worked out a nice little plan with your make-believe war, and what do you intend to do with all those diamonds? I don't know what you're talking about. I think Wallace and Aria Minude will have no trouble seeing what a diabolical schemer you are. Your machinations were on the verge of putting these communities to fire and sword. <laughs> do you know that you're charming when you're enraged? It's all over, Alexander. I'm going to hand over the evidence of your foul deeds to the authorities. My foul deeds? Come now, let's not get carried away. There must be some mistake. You don't fool me anymore. Listen, let's go together and see Wallace and Aria Minude. You can explain it all to them. Hmm, I don't think so. What a shame that you've taken sides with them. We could have gotten on like a house on fire. Alexander, what you have done is disgraceful. Aris Mohul, get rid of her. Adieu, Ariane. In jail? I'm in jail? I mustn't stay here a minute longer. Um, hi. Hello, my name is Ariane, and... No, 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 I ask not to be disturbed. Can you tell me where I am? You're in my home and I want you to get out at once. Well, I would like to, but I don't see how. I was teleported here. Confound it, another one of Alexander's whims. Do you know how to get out of here? <laughs> When Alexander shut me in here, I was furious. But since he gave me everything I needed to recreate my laboratory here, I stopped trying to escape. I like peace and quiet. And then in walks the little lady. What is this instrument? Ah, uh, this is my dynamic periscope. You like it? 
How does it work? It has a number of rare and fragile parts, so don't touch it. Soon I will be able to see the starry sky above the surface of the Earth. Very interesting. Do you know Alexander, the rector of the academy? Yes, he is my brilliant and unbearable brother. Are you Peter? Yes, that's me. A few years ago we had a, a, a clash of interests. Now he takes advantages of my ideas, but I take advantage of his bad conscience. He can't refuse me anything. Is it missing any parts to make it run? Yes, I, I have to order the parts that are circled on my diagram. The problem is I need to illuminate the interior. Something seems to have fallen inside. With my lighter, maybe I can... No, no flame. The inside is coated with a flammable material. You know what? If you would help me get out of here, I might be able to find the spare parts you need. You? No, 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 no. I don't want anything, and I certainly don't want you making a mess of things. Okay, okay. I get the message. Then I'll let you get back to your work. Yes, please do. I forbid you to touch anything. Okay, I read you loud and clear.